So we had some exciting news uh, statewide yesterday. We are uh, the UIL uh, set put out their realign their their biannual realignment, uh, rotated on on the enrollments of each of our schools. So our our first uh, district of choice is going to be our 32 6 a district. We are, we lost uh, Westlaco. The, dis the defending district champions in football. Uh, they're moving up to the uh, Upper Valley for 31-6A. So we're gonna be uh, moved into, a, into a, a five team district, the only five team district in the Rio Grande Valley, which produces some challenges with uh, finding non-district games. Uh, Brownsville Veterans uh, was formerly a, a 5A Division I team last year due to enrollment, has, in has moved up into, into the 32-6A ranks. So they'll be joined with Hannah this next year. Los Fresnos, San Benito, and Harlingen. In 5A Division I, Brownsville Rivetta's enrollment has, has decreased and put them in a new district. So they will be the only team in Brownsville ISD competing in a very difficult and very challenging uh, 5A, uh, 5A Division I. Uh, they'll be competing against teams like uh, Flower Bluff, Corpus Christi Veterans, uh, Enberg Vela, and PSJ North, just to name a few. Uh, 5A Division II also saw some changes. So we had some uh, because of the decline in some of our enrollments at Pace and at Lopez, they'll be dropping down to 5A Division II into a into a, uh, a five te uh, five teams or actually a six team uh, district. So they'll be uh, playing with uh, Ed Couch Elsa and Mercedes and uh, PSJ Southwest combined with Pace Porter and Lopez. So. Uh, in football, we have some opportunities to be able to get some teams in the playoffs next year that, that, have, that have been waiting uh, to, to, to make that. It should be very exciting for Brownsville ISD.